All right, let's do this. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> Fucking like pincered me in there between the lasers. What a hard boss. <laughs> Do you have to double jump by now? Like when you fight that guy? Because if you didn't have the double jump, I could see why it'd be hard, but otherwise, it's just whatever. Oh, shit. I'm doing so bad right now. I think he's almost dead. Ooh, look at that parry on accident. Fuck. Yeah, I feel like for a lot of these bosses, I just kind of... There's a wail out of them until they die. Um, this boss is so creepy, man. Oh. I got outplayed by the gravity. Oh, fuck you. I'm losing a lot of health to a boss that doesn't attack you. Oh. Ah. That's such a creepy boss. Oh, 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 movement. <laughs> God. Just the fact that she doesn't attack you and like there's just this like eerie music gets me. And yeah, for Trader Lord, you can just stay close. Because you can just pogo that, you can just walk when he does that. Ugh. Oh. Yeah. It's a very straightforward fight. Ugh. Oh. I say straightforward, I'd like botch that pretty bad. <laughs> Wait, I got this. Uh, uh. Damn it, I want to pogo him. Honestly, like, if you're using Mark of Pride, you can just outrange him while he's throwing shit. Literally throwing shit. Uh! <laughs> no! I wanted to keep pogoing him. There's like this video that I saw of some dude that managed to pogo White Defender the entire time. Like, his entire health bar, he just pogoed away. I want to be able to do that. Like, I want to be that good. I think you probably need like Dash Master and Sprint Master for that to keep up. Oh, it doesn't even matter that I was playing recklessly there, because we have a fountain. Oh yeah, for charms I'm just using Unbreakable Strength, Quick Nail, and Mark of Pride. Those are the main ones. And honestly, with those with those charms, the, the game just gets very easy. Or much easier, I should say. Not very easy, but it's still, still hard for me. But, like... Using those three charms just makes things so much, so much easier. <laughs> and from there I also have, what is it, Stalwart Shell, the one that stops you from knocking back when you hit. And then I also have, uh, what, what, what's my last charm actually, is it Nail? No, it's, uh, <laughs> I just charged up to see if I had Nail, my, nail Art, whatever it's called. Uh, what is my last charm actually, I'm not sure anymore. <laughs> Damn it! We're gonna heal up here. What is my last charm? I'm not sure. Oh, it's Grub Song. I guess it. It's okay, I guess, because you know you are taking damage a bit. But that last spot, I don't. I really don't care too much for it. 
fuck. <laughs> just immediately run into him. Oh my god. <laughs> Not even trying to dodge right now. Oh god, dude. Just stop being annoying. <laughs> yeah, for that one, I'm, honestly, I just rushed that one. Like, I'll just wholly admit that I rushed that one. Because I think the trick is just to hit him sideways instead of hitting him like up and down so that you can have an easy follow up. But anyway, like it doesn't matter because after that fight you have this one with the Watcher Knights and there's just so much downtime and there's so many times that you attack them like you just build up so much soul and you just can just heal everything back. So it really doesn't matter how much damage you take here. God. Oh my god, they're just so out of sync. Oh my god. <laughs> yeah, I'm not doing well right now. Part of me doesn't want this to be the run. One part that sucks about this game is that there's just so many particles that go around when you get hit. It gets really disorienting when you get hit by an enemy and it's like you can't really react that well because there's just so much shit on your screen. I'm gonna heal. Oh my god. Yeah, like there's definitely some fights where I'm just like, I just can't see my screen right now because there's so many particles. It's just a little bit distracting. Also, I'm just super fucking tilted, so there's that too. And then this dude just kind of just, just dash up to him and attack him. You have to just really just play aggressively, which kind of sucks because if you play aggressively, then you won't have your dash for invulnerability. But it's just kind of a sacrifice that you have to make. Oh fuck! I thought I could hit him there. Fuck! I am doing really bad. Like I know people say that, but holy shit, dude! This is unforgivably bad. I'm tilting myself. I think that's what it is. <laughs> Please don't be the run. I don't want people to see this. Ah, oh, I went the other way. What the fuck is wrong with me right now? <laughs> no. No. Stop being such a little bitch. Uh, God. Like for this fight, it's not hard, it's just you don't have a lot of times that you can attack him. It's kind of like Umu. Fuck, I got greedy. I really don't mind wasting so a little bit of health because the next fight or there's a little break anyways so it doesn't really matter there we go i can heal here why not oh man you're in the air <laughs> dude come down what the fuck <laughs> Alright, I've been practicing this next guy, so we should be fine, right? Ah, <sighs> let's go, beach.
probably not gonna talk a lot for this one. damage. Nice. Ooh. Dude, it had to be the run where I just botch all the other bosses, dude. <laughs> it couldn't be the other runs where it was the other way around, but I'll take it. I'll take it if it means getting closer to 100%. Oh, what is this? What just happened? What just happened? <laughs> this is awesome, Soul and Shade. All right, now it's time for the last one. Let's see.